Story time. It is story, story, story time. Yippee! It's time for a new story. Everyone's ready. One, two, three. A cloud of trash is hanging over Chiku's head, making her the unhappiest girl in the world. Read this wonderful story to find out how Chiku gets rid of this horrible trash cloud. The title of the story: A Cloud of Trash, written by Karanjit Kaur, illustrated by Bhavna Vyas Viparthi. The story is published by Pratham Books, narrated by Asavari Doshi. If you would like to listen more stories, then please visit our website. www.booksthatspeak.com Chiku was the unhappiest girl among her friends she was certainly the unhappiest girl in her entire class she was perhaps the unhappiest girl in the world friends chiku had no friends anymore no one wanted to play with chiku because she had a cloud hanging over her head a cloud of trash mm. orange peels and biscuit packets broken toys and pencil shavings twisted plastic bottles and colorful plastic bags all surrounded by a swarm of buzzing flies mm. no one wanted to play with a girl who had a cloud of trash hanging over her what if a rotten banana peel fell on your head yeah chiku could not even play hide and seek anymore the cloud would always give her away let's walk to school together she said to sona sona ran off in the opposite direction uh may i borrow your pencil sharpener she asked sweety sweety made a face mm. and change her seat to go to sit with asha chiku even had to eat her lunch all alone chiku knew that she should have listened to her amma amma always told her not to litter don't throw the banana peel on the road throw the empty biscuit packet in the dustbin but chiku never listened she only laughed and kept littering then one day amma became very angry soon all this trash will start following you she said chiku just laughed the next morning chiku woke up to a foul smell mm. and the sound of buzzing flies mm. the cloud of trash was hanging over her head amma's words had come true and then Chiku was unable to laugh. Chiku tried to run away, but the trash cloud followed her everywhere. Chiku took a broom to sweep the cloud down, but the trash could not be swept away. Chiku tried everything. She screamed and asked the cloud to leave her alone. She even tried throwing the cloud into the dustbin. but the cloud of trash just would not go so chiku became very unhappy then something happened chiku saw bala throwing a banana peel on the road chiku was annoyed could he not see the cloud over her head oh hey, silly boy she yelled don't throw the peel on the road someone will slip Bala scared of the trash cloud threw the pill in the dustbin the next day the trash cloud had become smaller how did that happen chiku wondered then chiku saw rima aunty throwing away plastic bags aunty chiku said please pick up these bags and reuse them rima aunty picked up the bags and left the next day when chiku woke up the cloud was much smaller chiku smiled 
she knew what she had to do. When someone threw away a biscuit packet or pencil shavings, Chiku stopped them. She picked up every twisted plastic bottle and put it in the dustbin. The village became cleaner and cleaner and Chiku's cloud became, yes, smaller and smaller. Until one day, it was gone, completely gone. Chiku was now perhaps the happiest girl in the world. Chiku never littered again. Secretly, she liked living in a clean village. But she was also scared that the trash cloud would come back someday. Who knew? Let's talk about trash. Ever wondered what happens to trash once you throw it away? No, it does not become a cloud on your head. The trash ends up in a big garbage bin near your home. When you litter, the trash collects by the side of the road. Some of it goes into the drains that carry waste water from your house. This clogs the drains and attracts flies which spread nasty diseases. Ugh. Nobody likes living in a dirty environment. Ask Chiku. Here is how not to make a cloud of trash. We can start by not littering our surroundings. Always, always throw waste into a dustbin. Look around for the nearest one. After you eat a banana, don't throw it on the road. Put the pill in a small bag until you find a dustbin. There are many things that you may think are useless like the paper bag into which you put the peel. But not everything is waste. So don't throw the bag with the pill. Take it home and reuse it. Cover dustbin so that flies can't get inside. Wow! That was fun, right? Do you want to hear more stories like this? Yes! Then log on to www.boxdadspeak.com Eruwa wee! Eruwa wee!